All right, all right. It is time again for a lottery masterpiece card hunt. I've done pretty good, I would have to say, out of my one box each of the six possible lottery card sets. I've gotten two so far. Um, so here's uh, another chance, another few chances. Let's see if we can do this again. So can't even get it open. Cannot even get this open. And now it's open. And it begins. All right, so Battle for Zendikar already found a lottery card out of this. And, of course, the rares we will be scanning up at the end. And we'll see what we get. So let's kind of just scoot on through these real quick. Got a Catacomb Sifter, Ulamog's Reclaimer, Pilgrim's Eye, and Angelic Captain, Angel Ally, and a Full Art Forest. Nothing wrong with that. Scan that up for a 33 cent rare. Boom. All right. That's how it goes. Full Art Forest there. All right. Second pack. Let's get that sweet, sweet masterpiece going on here. Night Watch outnumber a stalker. We got uh, Royals Retribution, Void Attendant, Malakir Familiar, and Ally Encampment. It's a land that does some stuff about allies. It's not a big one. It scans up as 45 cents. There it is. So another forest to go with my other forest. All right, Aether Revolt, which I think is the other one. I got a Steel Overseer out of, I believe, an Aether Revolt pack. Correct me if I'm wrong. Um, so, another possible dead draw here. We've got a Shock. Some Obsolescence that just flew everywhere. There we go. The Automaton. Examination. Another Automaton. Uh, it's a different automaton, an Aegis and an Augmenting Automaton. That really threw me off. I don't know if you can tell. Skyship Plunderer, Aeronaut Admiral, Crackdown Construct, and Heroic Intervention. Pretty decent card. Give all your permanents hexproof and indestructible. And it's 10 bucks. So that is pretty decent. There we go. All right. Next pack of AR. Wrangle it up. Get away. Tampering. Negate. Gifted Aetherborn. We're going to scan this and see if it's even 90 cents at this point. Uh, it's not a Mystery Booster card. It's not a Jumpstart card. It's an Aether Revolt. It's a buck. 15. Narnum Renegade. Hidden Stockpile. Release the Gremlins. That's, that's cute. Destroy some artifacts and create some gremlins. It's 39 cents. We got a Tezzeret emblem. I'll check it. It's an emblem for a mythic. It's 25 cents. There it goes. Okay, Hour of Devastation. Been opening these. Almost this complete box. Probably got a couple more videos in this series. And I don't recall getting any of the gods out of this box but I also forget everything that I pulled out of six boxes so maybe I did I've got a Kenra maybe I'm due for a god is what I'm saying J Jeru's Renunciation Jeru on summon we got a Sunset Pyramid Claim to Fame Dune Diviner and Neheb the Eternal that's a mythic at least he's a legendary zombie Minotaur warrior He's got Afflict 3. Whenever this creature becomes blocked, defending player loses 3 life. Don't block him. At the beginning of your post combat main phase, add 1 red to your mana pool. For each 1 life your opponents have lost this turn. Seems solid. You'd want to do that. And there's no masterpiece. But Neheb is an $18 card. That's great. And I can see why. He probably does a lot of damage on the battlefield. There we go. All right. H-O-D. Yeah, you know me. Are you down with H-O-D? Dutiful Servants. Combatant. A Rot Beast. Look at that guy. A Survivor. 
Deserts, life goes on. It sure does. We got Gideon's defeat, torment of scarabs, burning fist minotaur, apocalypse demon. It's a uh, power and toughness each equal to the number of cards in your graveyard. If you give your upkeep, tap him unless you sacrifice another creature. All right, let's see. How does he rate? He's a thirty-five cent card, and we did a, get a full art there and a Zambino. Take off one of those. All right, so Neheb, pretty good. Everything else, not so much. Oath of the Gate Watch. Well, I'm sorry, Heroic Intervention was good. O to the G, Cultivator Drone, Expedite, the Translator. There's a Wastes, pull that one. Relief Captain, No Color, Havoc Sower, Goblin Dark Dwellers. It's got Menace and a Foil. Full Art Mountain, that's kind of nice. So, that's... Is that a flooded strand? No, I guess it's not. The scanner does that, like, a lot, honestly. <laughs> Huge difference, 49 cents. Got a Full Art Mountain and a uh, foil. Um, let's see what it thinks about that. As a foil, it is three bucks. Hey, that's pretty good. And a wastes is not bad either, 83 cents. All right. Oath of the Gate Watch. Yeah, whenever the scanner has a little bit of glare, it sees a flooded strand for some reason. Abstruse interference. That's exactly what that uh, glare is. Strike. Another wastes. Immolating glare. Null collar. Wall of resurgence. This frame looks pretty good. What is that? Deceiver of form. Okay, this is an Eldrazi frame. Deceiver of Form is 49 cents. And a Plains. All right. Moving on to Kaladesh. Come on, Invention. Yeah, I think the Overseer that I got before was an Aether Revolt card, so there's a chance. you tell me there's a chance. Blade Master, the Herald. Live Fast and Open Magic cards. Aether Born Marauder. Glint Nest Crane, Restoration Gearsmith, PNLR, Legendary Human Artificer of 34 cents. We got a Swamp and a Servo. Okay. Another pack. Reckless Fire Weaver. Another Herald. Turtle. Mind Rot. Hunt the Week, we got an Arborback Stomper, a Trusty Companion, oops, a Whirler Maker, and an Inspiring Vantage. I always spoil it. Uh, pretty good. These these lands uh, have been doing pretty decently lately. So, um, what do they call these? Unless you control two, fewer, two or fewer other lands. It's a fast land. Is that what they call these? 873. We'll take it. An Island and a Servo. All right, Amiket. Last two chances here. The Bloodlust Inciter. And a Sacred Cat. Paralysis, that's me. Can't even decide. Nest of Scarabs, I actually really like this card. Embalmer's Tool. Tools, Cast Out, and Hazaret's Favor. And... What? At the beginning of combat on your turn, you may have a target creature you control get plus two and gain haste until end of turn. If you do, sacrifice it at the beginning of your next step. All right, fine. It's probably nothing. It's nothing. Mountain and a story card. Here we go. Last pack. Let's get it. Let's get it. I've got a fan bear, a taw crop skirmisher, colossipede, a scarab feast, the impact. Decision paralysis. Whoops. Horned Coppish. Cartouche of Ambition. Trial of Strength. Bontu's Monument. Cast Out. And Scattered Groves. Alright. It's a cycling land. And we get a swamp. That was three bucks. And an exerted embalmed token thing. So no masterpiece this time. Um the odds are not in my favor at this point. I've already gotten two out of six boxes, so that's kind of ahead of the curve. But we've got a couple more 
videos to do in this series and it's pretty much done so a couple more chances at glory here so anyway catch me back later tragic mtg take it easy